so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Blippi! <laughs> hey, it's me, Blippi. And today we're at Gravity Indoor Trampoline Park in Las Vegas, Nevada. <laughs> this is going to be fun. Hey. <laughs> Come on. Wow, look at this place. There's so many trampolines here. And this place is where we're going to do some jumping. See? This is jumping. Whoa! Here I go. a big clear ball and it looks like it's ready for me to get inside come here hello hey do you see me whoa This is a kangaroo. Will you act like a kangaroo with me? Ready? <laughs> Kangaroos can jump really high and really far. A kangaroo can jump four and a half times its body length. What that means is if I was a kangaroo, I would be able to jump over a double-decker bus. Wow, that's really far. Okay, let's go do some more jumping. Come on. It's like an airbag. Whoa, but it's really big. This is the same type of airbag that stunt men and stunt women use in Hollywood. That means you fall on it and it's really soft. So I think it's time for us to be a movie star. <laughs> okay, watch, come here. Hey, in this scene, I get really scared, and then I fall on my back, because I'm the stunt devil. Ready? Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Did you see that? It didn't even hurt. <laughs> that was awesome. I'm totally a movie star. Let's do another scene. So in this scene, I go really high in the sky and I jump out of an airplane and I land on the ground on my bottom. <laughs> Whoa! All right! Hey! Here I go! Action! <laughs> that was awesome! <laughs> Whoa! Now I am a movie star! Look at this! Wow! It's another animal! And this animal, yeah, is a cougar. Will you act like a cougar with me? Cougars can jump really high and really far. 
cougars can actually jump 10 times their body height. So that means if I was a cougar, I would be able to jump over, yeah, three giraffes. Wow, that is really high. Okay, let's go do some more jumping. That was a close one. That was a close one too. Better luck next time. Come on. Welcome to the dodgeball ring. This is where you and I are gonna play some dodgeball. But first, come over here. Hey, check out these balls. We have a red ball, a yellow ball, and a silver, a gray ball. I don't know what color that is. Kind of looks silver or gray. All right, go over there. Good luck. All right, here we go. Let's go do some more jumping. picture of an animal. Yeah, and this animal can also jump really high. This animal, yeah, is a frog. Will you act like a frog with me? Okay, here we go. Ribbit, 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 ribbit. <laughs> that is so funny. Frogs can jump really high and really far. Frogs can actually jump 20 times their body height. So that means if I was a frog, that would be like me jumping over two Spinosauruses. Wow, that is really high. <laughs> Let's go jump some more, shall we? like a rope right here. All right, here I go. Whoa, I did it. Whoa. <laughs> That's awesome. Oh. Oh. There's even some more stuff over here, look. 
What are these things? They look like pieces of cheese. But, like moldy cheese. They're black in color. All right, I'll go across them. That was a tricky one. <laughs> bunch of rope with these foam things inside. Looks like I need to go across. Whoa! Whee! <laughs> All right. On these platforms. See, these are clear. You can see through them. See? Whoa. They're very wobbly. I'm gonna get off of these. Okay. Oh, I see some more foam pits over here with trampolines in them. Let's go. trampoline and we're gonna jump on it and this is a foam pit look there's a couple colors here's the color red huh here's the color yellow huh. Ooh. here's the color dark gray or black I can't tell it's kind of tricky okay Ooh. the color orange Wow. Ooh, and the last color in here. Do you know this color? What color is this? Yeah! This is the color purple. Now it's time for me to jump in it. Are you ready? Here I go. That was so crazy! Oh, that's fun! Whoa! Whoa, look at this! Wow! This? Yeah, isn't an animal. This is an insect. And this is a flea. Let's act like fleas together. So fleas can jump really high and really far. Fleas can actually jump 220 times their body length and 150 times their body height. Wow, that is crazy. So that means if I was a flea, I would be able to jump over four football fields and one Seattle Space Needle at the same time. Wow, that is so crazy, flea. <laughs> All right, let's do some more jumping. Not this time, let's go. Hello. Whoa. <laughs> okay. Oh. Oh. Let's grab this. This is a pole. It's like I'm a trapeze artist. Here I go! Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> oh. ah. Whoa! That was so much fun jumping around with you. Well, let's recap. What did we learn today? Well, we learned that kangaroos like to jump. Yeah. Cougars like to jump. Frogs like to jump. Fleas like to jump. 
And all of those creatures jump really high and really far. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Let's spell Blippi together, ready? B-L-I-P-P-I, Blippi. Good job, see you soon. Whoa, hey, it's me, Blippi, and look at where I'm at. Whoa, today I'm at I Fly Indoor Skydiving in Seattle, Washington. This is so cool, yeah, indoor skydiving. Yeah, normal skydiving is when you jump out of a plane. Whoa, I'm so scared. <laughs> and then you pull out your parachute and go to the ground. But today we get a skydive inside. Yeah, there's some giant fans that push air and pull air up. And then you're right here and then you're flying. Yeah, I am so excited. Let's go. Hey. What an eye flight, Lippy! Whoa, thanks for having me! Go ahead and head on upstairs to the flight deck. We're ready for you to fly. All right, let's go. Come on. Flight deck viewing area. Oh, the flight deck must be right up here. Whoa, I am so excited. Whoa, here it is. Wow, this is the flight deck. Yeah, this is where you can watch. But this is the flight chamber. <laughs> I am so excited. Whoa, check it out. Inside the flight chamber, it looks like there's a lot of colorful balls and a couple toys. Hey, I have an idea. Why don't we turn on the flight chamber and see what items fly in the air first? <laughs> Come on. Whoa, 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 wait a second. We need some safety gear on. Hey, right over here, we have the yellow lockers. Whoa. <laughs> yep, it's this one. <laughs> All right, we have goggles. Oh, they're nice and clear. <laughs> Protects our eyes. Perfect. Then, we have some earplugs. Put it in the ear. Perfect. Roll it. And here's another ear. And they're both plugged. So now we can go inside and see what items fly. Whoa, check it out. <laughs> I have my tote right here. And then I'm gonna see what items fly first. It looks like we have some just normal wiffle balls, a blue one and a pink one. Ooh, oh, we have a rubber ducky. Hey, look, and a rubber chicken. <laughs> All right, hey, look over here. Whoa, a big basketball. Whoa. <laughs> All right, let's turn it on and then we'll see what items fly. Do you hear that? Whoa! The balls are starting to move! Whoa! Okay, guys, oh, let's go! idea. Why don't I pour some of this water out and see if it floats in the air? <laughs> Ready? Whoa! Whoa! Do you see that? It's just hovering in the air. Whoa! <laughs> see you later, water droplets. <laughs> They're flying really high in the air. I'll do some more. Whoa! A little bit more, and then I have a secret toy. Whoa! 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 They're getting on me. I'm getting wet. 
Okay, check this out. All right, now I have this really cool squirter right over here. And I'm gonna suck it up. All right, now this is full of water. Are you ready? Whoa. Normally when I squirt this, it squirts out really far. But now, is a lot of water. <laughs> Whoa! That was so much fun playing with all those toys and seeing what water does when air is coming super fast from below. But the point of this place is not to play with toys, it's to use our bodies and fly in the air ourselves. So let's learn how to do this in the classroom. <laughs> Whoa! All right, what do we do? Hey, Blippi, we're gonna watch a quick video, teach you everything you need to know, and, uh, and then we'll go fun. Awesome, all right, I guess we get to watch a video. <laughs> your legs and that's to relax yeah. a little bit got it and number one rule chin up all right you sound ready to go let's go get all your equipment on okay let's go get your helmet your goggles light suit all right going. so i'm gonna put on all the safety gear on so then we can fly yeah all right looks like i have a lot of stuff to put on looks like i have my flight suit a helmet, some goggles, and some earplugs. <laughs> okay, three, two, one. Whoa, check it out. Yeah, how do I look? Woo, I am ready to fly. Let's head to the flight chamber. Okay, now let's let the expert go. Come on. This is gonna be awesome. Whoa, look at the whole machine. Wow, it's so big. Okay, here he goes.
and wiggled. Just kidding, he didn't wiggle. He stayed nice and calm. Yeah, it was so cool. I had so much fun. And when I went, there's just tons of air pushing against my chest and my body. And when I went smaller, I went down. But then when I expanded, I went up. Yeah, because there's more, more surface area. Wow, that was so much fun. <laughs> I cannot wait to do this again. <laughs> well, oh. Whitney, you did such a good job. Whoa. We have a flight certificate for you, and we'd love to have you back. So what is this? <laughs> flight job. certificate? Well done. Thank you so much. Wow, I just got a flight certificate because I completed a flight at iFly. fun at I fly indoor skydiving in Seattle, Washington. Whoa, it was so cool being able to have air push me from the bottom and make me feel what flying feels like. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> that was so much fun. But this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more. <laughs> oh, hey, it's me, Flippy. And today, we're here at the Special Spirit Organization and Danny's Farm <laughs> here in Los Angeles, California. And we get to meet some amazing animals. Yeah, I am so excited. This is gonna be so much fun. Come on. Whoa, look at it. <laughs> it's a horse. Hello. <laughs> yeah. And this horse has a name. Its name is Jasper. Hello, Jasper. <laughs> Jasper is so sweet. Look, Jasper is the colors white and brown. Whoa, Jasper is so nice and really soft to pet. <laughs> hey, and look at this. Jasper's eyes are different colors? Whoa, <laughs> that is a really big word called Heterochromia. Whoa! <laughs> That's a big word that basically means someone has two different color eyes. Yeah. This eye is the color brown. And this eye over here, whoa, it's the color blue. Whoa, <laughs> you have really pretty eyes, Jasper. Whoa! This horse is so big and so beautiful. Yeah, Christopher Pine, the color brown. Whoa. And he's just eating some hay. Whoop. Hello. <laughs> yeah, just eating some hay. That's what horses eat. They eat lots of hay. <laughs> Whoa. And look, this big horse has a mane just like Jasper and a tail just like Jasper. Whoa. And some really big feet. Look at it. Do you know what the name is for a horse's feet? <laughs> They're called hooves. Yeah, look at them. Horses have hooves. <laughs> well, I've had so much fun learning about horses. have an idea. How about you and I ride a horse in real life? <laughs> yeah! <laughs> if only we knew someone who could help us. Hello, I'm Blippi. Oh. I'm Keegan. <laughs> hi, Keegan. This is Apache. Oh, hi, Apache. Keegan, can I ride Apache? Yes, you can, <laughs> Yeah! I'm so excited to ride Apache. Okay, Apache. I'm gonna get on. Good boy, Apache. Good You're boy, early. Apache. Ooh. Whoa, look, I'm on Apache. We're gonna go on the sensory trail. Yeah, this trail uses all of your five senses. There's things to see, 
listen to, and touch. Woo. <laughs> I'm so excited. Okay, let's go. Walk on, Apache. <laughs> Apache's a really good listener. Well, look, we're coming up to the first thing in the sensory trail. Whoa! A stop sign, whoa! Okay, walk on. <laughs> hey, look, there's some bells. Woo! <laughs> look at that! Look at that! They sound so pretty in the wind, and even prettier when you play with them. Woo! <laughs> okay, walk on. Let's see what else there is here. Walk on. Whoa! Over the bridge! <laughs> Woo! And through the car wash! Woo! <laughs> hey, look! We have Apache and Cherokee, and we're gonna walk them to give them a treat. Let's go! Whoa! You guys are so cute! Whoa, horses are amazing! Oh, hello, Keegan. Whoa. Okay, here you go. Now, time to give him some treats. <laughs> hello. You like a carrot? Whoa. Ooh, they love carrots. <laughs> and Apache's really hungry because I rode him. <laughs> Whoa. Hey, maybe Cherokee wants some too. Cherokee, would you like a carrot? You want a carrot? Oh no. Uh oh. Let me get that for you. It fell. <laughs> wow. Okay, here. I'll give you another carrot so that they both have the same amount of carrots and apples. Mmm. <laughs> so tasty. <laughs> hey! Whoa! Look at where I am! <laughs> Inside the pen with all the animals. <laughs> There's so many different kinds. And look, it's Sunny. Hello, Sunny. <laughs> Sunny is a goat. <laughs> I love goats. They're so cool. Whoa. Hello. And Sunny is two colors. Look, the color golden brown and the color white. <laughs> yeah. Sunny is a really good goat. Yeah. <laughs> Goats are really cool because they're really great climbers. <laughs> Ooh, they can climb up all types of things and hop up on stools like this. Yeah, they can just climb on up. <laughs> no problem. Hey, do you know what a little goat is called? <laughs> yeah, a kid. <laughs> just like you. <laughs> or just like when I was little. A kid. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, but did you know? When goats are born, they walk right away. Yeah, they're born, and even though they're babies, they can walk. Whoa, that's so cool. <laughs> hey, let's see if we can see some goats up close. Come on. Hello. Hi. Whoa. Look, it's Sunny. Yeah. Sunny is a boy goat. But look, there's also a girl goat. Hello. <laughs> look at this. Sunny is a different color from this goat. This goat is kind of speckled, white and black. <laughs> Whoa. They're so sweet and really soft. <laughs> hey, did you know that goats, they like to burp? <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> and they're so cute and so Fun to pet. Whoa, but look at this guy. Do you know what kind of animal this is? <laughs> yeah, that's right. This is a pig. <laughs> Can you make a pig noise like me? <laughs> or partly. <laughs> yeah, this pig, well, actually, not this pig. This pig over here is named Hartley. And this is Hartley's mama. <laughs> Hello, mama. Ah, uh, <laughs> mama is really sweet. 
Oh, I forgot. Let's make those pig noises. <laughs> Can you make them with me? <laughs> so silly. Oh, pigs are so smart and really good smellers. Yeah, look. You see the pig's nose? Whoa, <laughs> that's a really big nose. It's bigger than my nose. <laughs> yeah, they're really, really good smellers so they can see their food. Whoa, and look, pigs. They're, they're kind of soft too, but not like a goat because pigs don't have fur and they don't have hair. Yeah, pigs have bristles. <laughs> yeah, right here. Whoa, they're kind of prickly. And it's kind of like hair, but it's a little firmer and harder. Yeah, they're really cool to touch and to pet. <laughs> and they give scratches. Pitch, pitch. <laughs> Aw, well, it's so nice to see these pigs. Whoa, and look, Hartley came to say hi. <laughs> this pig is called Hartley because this little white heart. Well, it kind of looks like a heart. Right, right there. Yeah. Whoa. Sunny and Mama and Hartley. <laughs> These animals are so amazing. Hmm. Oh, and you see this other animal? <laughs> oh. Do you know what this animal is called? I'll give you a hint. This animal goes like this. Yeah, this animal is a sheep. Ooh. <laughs> Hello, sheep. This sheep is really, really nice. <laughs> yeah. And sheep, they have wool on their back. Mm -hmm. Some types of sheep, yeah, they just shed kind of like a dog. Yeah, some sheep, they shed the wool on their back. But other kinds of sheep, like this sheep right here, they need to get a haircut. Yeah, they have shears, which are kind of like haircut scissors for sheep. <laughs> and they just give the sheep a little haircut on the back. But it's really important to not cut the hair on the back of the sheep so that they don't get too hot in the sun. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of like wearing a hat, but <laughs> the hat is on your back. Whoa, <laughs> that's so silly. Whoa. Hey, did you know something else? Sheep are vegetarian. That's a really big word. Well, they're not vegetarian. <laughs> that would be as if they're a human, then they'd be a vegetarian. Sheeps are herbivores. Whoa, herbivores are what sheeps are, and vegetarians, that's what some people are. <laughs> yeah, and that means herbivores only like to eat plants. <laughs> yeah, plants, no meat. <laughs> Whoa, these sheep are so cool. Whoa, that was so amazing uh. learning about sheep and goats and all kinds of animals here at Danny's farm. <laughs> I had uh. so much fun with you and so much fun with you. <laughs> Hello! <laughs> well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. <laughs> hey, will you spell my name with me? <laughs> okay, they're going to help spell it too. <laughs> B-L-I. P-P-I. Blippi. Good job. Well, I'll see you real soon. I'm going to get these guys <laughs> and gals some treats. Bye-bye. It's me, Blippi, and today I'm at Woodland Park Zoo in Seattle, Washington. <laughs> I am so excited to learn about penguins. <laughs> Whoa! Look at these animals! Yeah, these are penguins, and they're actually humble penguins. Oh, they are so cute. Hello. <laughs> These penguins, yeah, their native land is Peru and northern Chile. Yeah, that's 
doesn't sound like a cold place. Those countries are actually really warm. So these penguins live basically in the desert. <laughs> is so soft. <laughs> yeah, since penguins are birds, they have a lot of feathers, and these feathers are really small and dense on its body. Oh, hey cutie. <laughs> and do you see its wings? Yeah, its wings actually are more like flippers because then they can swim super fast in the water. And actually, penguins actually can't even fly with their wings. That's okay because you're a really good swimmer. <laughs> Oh, check it out. Do you see how this penguin doesn't have stripes? Yeah, there's just teeny little black dots. Hey, and the one right behind it, yeah, there's those big black stripes. That one is an adult. So front one is a child, and the back one is an adult. Whoa, hey. <laughs> They're almost the same size though. <laughs> how are you? Are you having a good day? Because <laughs> I sure am. Do you see these penguins? Yeah, they look like cute pets, don't they? Yeah, but they're actually not. Penguins don't make good pets. Although they're nice, yeah, they're living at the zoo so we can take care of them and we can learn about them. And the more we learn about these cute humble penguins, the better we can take care of their cousins around the world. <laughs> Whoa, penguins? Yeah. We're behind the scenes at the aquarium, and we're going to meet some penguins. Come on. OK. Let's walk nice and slow, and we'll be very quiet as well. Ooh. Hey, who are you? Hutch. Ooh, this is Hutch. Hey, what do you do here? I work with the penguins and reptiles. Ooh, the penguins and the reptiles. Oh, do you see the penguins back there? Oh, hello. Are these your only two penguins here? Oh, no, we have more friends that are coming. Would you like to grab a toy? We're actually going to play with them. Sure. Okay, let's grab a toy and let's see some more penguins. Look over there. movement with their toys. So we have Violet that has already come over to say hi. It, it looks like it's enjoying my shadow, huh? That does happen. So penguins really like contrasting colors. They also can see colors really well. They have rods and cones in their eyes just like we do. Okay. They're kind of, although they're birds, they're kind of acting like kitty cats, huh? Just a little bit. They do like to play with a lot of different types of toys. And just like kitty cats, they tell us when they want to be touched. Okay. Huh, interesting. It's pretty cool. Hey, get a closer look. Oh, bye-bye. <laughs> but penguins are so silly. So where are these penguins from? These penguins are from South Africa. Okay. And we have 32 of them here. Wow, 32 penguins here. And these are from South Africa? Yes. Not Antarctica? Not Antarctica. They're actually one of several species of penguins that prefer the warm climate. Oh, okay. That's pretty cool. Interesting. Warm climate and penguins. I guess you learn something every day. <laughs> okay, let's take a seat right over here. And then Hutch is going to bring a penguin over. <laughs> I'm so excited. I get to touch a penguin. Ooh, hello. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to touch the penguin with two fingers gently on its back. Okay, are you ready? There we go. Okay. 
Oh, it felt so soft. Did you know penguins have 70 feathers per square inch? Yeah, they're really small and really dense. Can I touch the gam punch? Yes, you can. Okay. Does that feel good? You like that? She's showing off for you. Ooh. What does that mean when she shakes her head? So that means she's really happy uh, and you might be her new boyfriend. Ooh. I hope she doesn't want to kiss. <laughs>ready to feed the penguins today so we have some of their favorite fish these are called ocean smell also known as silver sides because they have that silver stripe on their side and I have herring it's silver like an anchovy and sardines just like they eat in the wild okay you guys ready to eat even hungry Ooh, I'm gonna try and feed the penguins Whoa, look at these fish. Whoa, if I was a penguin, I would sure want to eat this. <laughs> okay, here you go. Oh, <laughs> here you go, penguin. Here's another one. Hey, there you go. Oh, <laughs> that one must be really hungry. <laughs> okay, here you go. These fish are a lot smaller. Here you go. Oh, perfect. You want another one? <laughs> Here's another one. Okay. <laughs> Excuse me, penguins. Here you go. Oh. <laughs> Here you go. Oh, you're hungry. <laughs> yeah. Fish are nice and healthy for these penguins. Ah. <laughs> All right. Yeah, just like how we eat fruits and vegetables. Yeah, they love fish. <laughs> um, how about you? You haven't had one? Oh, whoa. There's so many <laughs> penguins that want food. <laughs> there you go. Oh, <laughs> whoa. All right, there you go. That one right here is so hungry. <laughs> they have gotten so many of the fish. Oh, here you go. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> okay, penguins, get ready. It sure has been a lot of fun learning about penguins with you. But this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? B-L-I-P-P-I. Flippy. Good job. All right. See you again. Hello, it's me, Flippy. 
today, we're in Tonino, Washington, in front of a greenhouse. Whoa! Do you know what a greenhouse is? Yeah, a greenhouse is a house that houses plants. Yeah! It controls the environment, so then you can make sure that the temperature is just right for the plants to grow really big. <laughs> Let's go inside and check it out. Come on. This place is awesome. There are so many plants here. Wow. Hey, look at this one. Yeah, it's a flower. Oh, oh smells so good. Looks so pretty. <laughs> yeah, check it out. Another one. Yeah, what color is this flower? Yeah, it's the color pink. Ooh, and all these leaves. What color are they? Yeah, the color green. Wow, flowers are so cool. You can put them on your tabletop and they look so pretty. Whoa, what kind of plants are these? Oh, they look real small compared to those flowers. Yeah, these are actually called succulents. Huh, interesting. They kind of look like cactuses. Yeah, but they're not pokey or anything. Actually, a cactus? Yeah, that's a type of succulent. Wow, succulents are so cool. Whoa. Ooh, some more flowers over here. Wow, there's so many flowers. A lot of greenhouses have flowers in them, or they could be growing fruits. Hmm, <laughs> I love fruits. And might grow vegetables. Yum! I love vegetables too. I really enjoy eating healthy. Do you eat healthy? Yeah, good job. But hey, what color is this flower? Yeah, it's the color purple. Come on. It's not a flower, it's not a fruit, it's not a vegetable. These look like a type of grass. Yeah, three different types of grasses. Look, whoa, looks like my hair. Hello, hey, <laughs> do I look silly or do I look silly? <laughs> oh, now that is silly. <laughs> Here's another type right here. Whoa, and another type. Whoa! Yeah, do you have grass at your house? You very well might. It's so fun to play in and roll in. Whoa, 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 <laughs> wow. <laughs> Ooh, there's so many plants in here. I enjoy greenhouses. Whoa, look at this. Wow, whoa, a big pot of Flowers. Did you see how it was hanging? Yeah, this looks like a nice, pretty bouquet of flowers. Yeah, a bouquet is where it's a big group of flowers, but typically you cut them off and then you can make a very colorful bouquet. Wow, so pretty. But this is also pretty and it's in a hanging pot. Wow, all right. We have to make sure we put things back where we found them. Woohoo! Whoa! Check these out. Wow, so many colors. What colors do you see right here? Looks like that one is pink. That one right there is red. Ooh, look at that one. It's the same color as the sun. Yeah, yellow. <laughs> Whoa! All right, I have a really fun thing for us to do together. Have you ever planted a plant? <laughs> yeah, it's so much fun. Do you see this? Yeah, you know what this is? It's a flower. It's an adult flower. It's really old. <laughs> and look at this one. 
This looks like a teenager or a baby. It hasn't even created the flower yet, but soon enough, this is going to turn into this. But in order for it to become this size, yeah, it starts out as a seed. Yeah, every single plant, like flowers, I should say, start out as seeds. All right, but the things that every plant needs are sun, water, soil, which is like a house, and nutrition, which is like food. Whoa, all right, so let's create this plant's house or home where we're gonna put the seed. Oh, there we go. Yeah, let's scoop up this soil. Oh, <laughs> I'm making a mess, that's okay. <laughs> I'll clean it up after. There we go. All right, this soil has a lot of nutrition already in it. Yeah, there we go. And sometimes the water that you put in this to water it has some nutrition in it as well. All right. So check this out. This right here is a flower seed. Wow. Do you see how small it is? Yeah, so cool. So when you put this right in here and you push it down, there we go. Okay, let's cover it up just a little bit. The soil is nice and moist. And then after a while, it's gonna sprout up. And it's gonna be so small and cute. Oh! <laughs> and then it'll grow up to be this. Wow, so green and pretty. <laughs> but when it becomes an adult, it is going to flower. Yeah, good job. All right, so what are the four things that every plant needs to grow? Yeah. It needs some sun, it needs some soil, it needs some nutrition, and it needs some water. Wow, this was awesome. <laughs> Walking through the forest, look at all the trees. They give us lots of air, what we need to breathe. Look at all the critters roaming on the ground They help carry the seeds to grow plants all around Flowers are a bloom and making lots of food For all the bugs and creatures, even me and you We're singing the earth song We're helping the planet Recycle paper, glass, and plastic Taking care of the earth Will make you feel fantastic You can plant a tree or pick up some trash Ask a friend for help Then it'll be a blast We're singing the earth song We're helping the planet Together, together We can make a change Song. Come learn all about it Together, together It's time we start Let's do our part Let's do our part Let's do our part learning about plants with you. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you wanna watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? B 
L I P P I Flippy. Good job. All right. See you again. Bye bye. Shout.